Hey, it's Santa from Jerry from Santa Switch Adapter Toys. This video is called What Color Wire Is It? Which Two Wires Is It? When you buy a stereo cable, what I do is I purchase these uh, six foot uh, stereo extension cables. And the stereo extension cables have, I've already cut this one, but has uh, three prongs on it. And so you have the tip, the ring, and the sleeve. So you have a tip, a ring, and a sleeve. Tip is common. One of these is your left ear and the other one is your right ear for stereo purposes. But on here, how do you tell which one it is? You can't see in there, you can't figure out what it is. This is going to go on the toy and this is going to go on the switch. So, got a couple here already stripped back. <clears throat> Inside of these, they happen to be a white, yellow, and a red. So which one of these is the tip, and which one is the sleeve, and which one's the ring? On here I've already got them twisted together because I figured out which one it was. So the easiest way to figure out which one these are is to plug them into a toy that has been adapted. Okay, <clears throat> that happens by the way it, because we're it's accidentally crossing those just plugging it in so sometimes it'll do that. And we want to figure out which two of these wires does not make the toy activated. So we're going to try a couple of wires, white and yellow. Yeah, touching him did did nothing. Red and yellow. Red and yellow did it. Okay. Red and white. Red and white did it. For this cable right here, we're going to put these white and the yellow ones together. Okay? Because we know that white and yellow is now one of those is the one of those is the sleeve, the other one's the ring. Red one on that wire is the tip. We know that because when this toy gets activated it's activated by these two being common and this being a separate one. So, this is what activates that toy and deactivates it. So that's what we're going to solder those together and we'll keep that separate. That makes two wires to put onto our switch. <clears throat> we're going to try to do the same thing with this. It's also got red, yellow, I'm sorry, white, yellow, and red. So what I've made up here is a cable that I know. I take I've taken one of those and I've added a, mon a stereo a mono plug to it. So it's a stereo plug on this end because that's the wire, it's the extension cable, and I've added a mono plug on this end. And I've already done the combination inside of here, so I know this is going to work. I'm going to plug that into the toy, and I'm going to plug this into the cable that I want to put into a toy. So we're going to activate this as a switch and see which ones turn on this toy. On the other one it was red touching either the white or the yellow would activate the toy. Let's see which one this is. Let's go with red touching the yellow. Nothing occurred. Let's go with yellow touching the white. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yellow and white activate the toy. Let's move the yellow out of the way. The only combination we haven't tested yet was white and red. So, white and red activate the toy. Yellow and red do nothing. We're going to twist those two together. And that now makes us a mono cable and when the white touches these two which are going to be combined it activates the toy. 
when you put this cable into your toy that you're adapting so that you can operate it with a uh, button switch that's how you're going to hook it up and that's the easiest way that I can think of to test these for people who are only doing a few at a time the way I test them is I take this cable that I've made up I made up a box here with the LED light in it so I can do a quick test and it's essentially going to be the same thing without the noise white and yellow activate white and red activate yellow and red do nothing I'm going to put these together and I'm going to solder them and I'm going to make up a batch of cables so that I can do toys this is only a few that I've done this evening I have a few hundred more that I will be doing before uh, before I progress to do some more toys so that's a, a quick way to, to a home test get a toy that works that you already know that works with a switch make up a a male to male this is a male to male connector for testing purposes only so that you can test this cable as you as you get it ready to go and we already know on this one I'm going to twist yellow and red together again I'm going to attach white to it activates and deactivates the toy okay thank you so what I should have mentioned in this when I was testing showing the wires and the cables was that when you open up your cable you may have multiple colors in there because manufacturers make the cables with whatever's on hand no one's going to see them nobody cares as long as they make the connection color doesn't matter so you may find combinations of wires inside your cable of white yellow red as we did you may find a white black red a black white blue a yellow green blue a yellow white green it whatever those combinations are it doesn't really matter you just need to find the two wires that do not activate the toy make sure they're separate and then the third wire standalone becomes the other side so you can make a mono cable out of that stereo